Hi, this is Billy uh, from Fujifilm. Today we're talking about the Fujifilm X-T20. This is the successor to the very popular Fujifilm X-T10 camera. Same size, same dimension, whole new camera. It uses, of course, the latest sensor and processor technology found on the X-T2 camera. So you get all the image quality and the performance. Very fast shot time, actually up to 14 frames per second using electronic uh, shutters and uh, of course very fast uh, you know, shutter continuous shooting to uh, 8 frames per second. Uh, some major upgrades with this camera coming from the sensor and the closer. You got one of the key features of course which is 4K video. You can shoot at 30 frames per second. You have all the controls found on the XE, X-T2. So things like of course film simulation modes to offer very quick 4K video shooting whether in color or in actual mode. This is a, a specialty of this camera. The size and dimension really holds the same even though it uses uh, of course all this new sensor and processor technology. Just like the X-T10, the new camera of course uses the electronic viewfinder. It's a 2.36 organic LED display. You also have this 3 inch tilting LCD again allowing you to shoot in low angles as well as high angle. In addition to that, of course, it's now a touch panel. So again, you can now use it uh, to, of course, change the focus, obtain focus, and move the focus area um, during shooting. It also works with video as well. So if you wanted to quickly pull focus in a scene, it reduces the shakiness of, of course, moving the, fo the focus points through the buttons. Uh, the playback mode, of course, on the touch screen also allows you to do things like pinch and zoom and swipe which will allow you to quickly, of course, uh, check the, uh, the focus in the shots. Double tapping brings, of course, you back out uh, the, of the full sensor, uh, full display. The dials, of course, the front and rear command dials have been upgraded. Again, you have a more metallic finish now to that. Same thing with the shutter release. They also are buttons as well and can, of course, control the camera. The exposure comp dial, just like uh, the X-T2 and X-Pro2, have been expanded. So you got a C dial there that can allow you to go plus or minus uh, five stops. Um, and, of course, using this camera really is, you know, uh, if you want small, you want compact, you want lightweight, but you want all the image quality, all the focusing speed, the, the, the shutter lag time of the X-T2. This is really the perfect package for you. The body itself I will retail for $899. There's also a kit option with the X-C 16 to 50 millimeter lens. That will be just $100 more at $999. And of course the very famous XF 18 to 55 F 2.8 F4 lens, that will retail of course for um, $1199. So again, really great price point if you want to get into the Fujifilm system and get all the image quality from of course the X-T2 lineup that uh, it really utilizes for hardware.